Are you a gay man? <laughs> no, it's a question. No, it's okay. That's, I have an uncle who's a homosexual, and I... It's okay. I, and I ha, we were raised in a house of tolerance, and I, I was... <laughs> whatever. So... Here's the thing. If you, uh, if you do jokes like that in the South, you talk about uh, people who are homosexuals and the, the real homophobic dudes come out and they're like, well, whatever, dude. You know, I'm cool. You know, I'm open-minded. People do whatever the hell they want. Privacy, their own closet. I don't care. <laughs> you just don't come hitting on Cooter. You know what I'm talking about, queer boy? Mm-hmm. <laughs> like that's ever going to happen. Oh, my God, Ivan, check out that guy in the NASCAR jacket and the John Deere cap throwing out the racial slurs. I love him. <laughs> Get him for me. I call dibs on NASCAR guy. <laughs> they got nothing in common. I asked my uncle, I was like 15, I asked my uncle, I go, uh, how long have you been gay, Uncle Danny? He goes, I was born gay. <laughs> yeah, I'm 15, so I'm like doing the math. I'm like, you're born gay? Like you just came right out of the womb going, oh my God, what the hell was that? I am never going back in there. <laughs> You ruined my birthday suit. It's... <laughs> Ew! Who is that spanking me? You are divine. Look at you. Go. I'm a bad baby. Bad baby. It's a theory. It's insane. It's weird. <laughs> Ah, oh, what a lovely crowd. <laughs> Breathe. People, people are, are, are basically nice. When Katrina happened, remember Katrina? When that happened in all the other countries? This is what I liked about it. All the other countries came out to help us for once. Wasn't that cool? They came to our assistance, and it's about time. Like, even Cuba called, and they're like, do you guys need some help? And we're like, no. <laughs> Screw you. Still. <laughs> we're not, we didn't even let them come over. Mexico just came over. That's what you guys do, just show up. And like, anyway. <laughs> Get in the truck! Drove across Texas, what a long, awkward drive for the Mexican army. This place looks familiar. (laughs) Iraq gave us a million dollars, like we can do something with a million bucks. That's like when the check comes at dinner and your six-year-old's like, I got it, daddy, gives you a buck. And you're like, oh, that's sweet, buddy. Why don't you keep that and write yourself a constitution so you can move out of my house. (laughs) 